So we um, we have a, a bit of a special announcement, and um, it's uh, obviously every once a quarter, or sometimes as long as it, once every half a year, we we come out with a special stock um, program. Not not so much. A new course, or or something like that. We're we're waiting for very specific market conditions where we design specific strategies to match the market today. Um, last year we did uh, we did two of these, uh, and it was called the big one and the big one two, and we did these on the uh, on both of the highs of the market when the market actually uh, dropped. Uh, about 10% after we had done those uh, done those sessions. The objective of these sessions is to find extra, um, macro and technical setups where a stock is really set to move, and um, and we're looking for um, 10, 20, 30 percent movement on the stock. So if we're trading the stock, that's what our expectation will be. Uh, in an option. Uh, we can we can possibly get more, and that's where we can if we get a 20, 30, 40 percent move on the stock, we can pick up three, four, five, six hundred percent of an option. Um, so those are the positions we're looking for. We're looking for very um, acutely positioned stocks. Of course, um, the the whole idea is to get the best risk reward, and um, and watching that movie. The uh, what's that movie? The Big Short the other day, and I uh, and it just reminded me of what the strategy is all about. I mean, they crunched the numbers and they did the work and they figured out a way to make billions of dollars picking one scenario that was going on in the market that was wrong and being able to figure out a way to capitalize it. So um, so far in the market this year, we've had a massive drop and we've had a massive recovery. Rally. Both were predicted by exactly what the technicals told us, what open range told us. Go short, go long. So looking ahead, do we have a bear or bull market? Well, who knows? We have to let the technicals tell us what the timing is on the direction. Because uh, when we look at the fundamentals, nothing has changed. We might have had this big rally, um, but as I've spoken about a lot, we can see that in the last 30 days, the ratio of selling to buying in every sector other than healthcare is extremely high in the selling favor. So um, when we start to say how healthy is the market in terms of where is investment capital going, it's not investing in their own companies. So um, the traders are buying, but the traders are looking to sell just as we are when we hit the targets. Investors are looking to buy and hold, but right now investors are selling. So that's one thing. Again, we talked about the, uh, I talked about the daily insider uh, buying amount and the fact that if you look at that graph, um, this is also from Insider Cow, you can see we're reaching record lows right around the point that we have big crashes. Whenever we get down to these levels, it's usually um, followed by a big correction. The, the crash of last year in October, uh, the crash of uh, the end of the year here in January, um, the crash in July when we fell was preceded by the drops to these levels. Where are we at? We're at these levels again. So it may not be tomorrow, it may not be next week, but the warning signs are still as loud as they ever were before. And it's uh, it's the people that pick up these things that make the money. Uh, again, in that movie, The Big Short, people thought he was crazy. He said Alan Greenspan was just on TV saying health could be the, the, the health of the um, uh, U.S. homes is, and U.S. real estate is healthier than it's ever been. Are you smarter than Alan Greenspan and the treasuries of the world? And he said yes. Uh, now, I'm not saying that, but I'm saying that there's signs we have to look at if we're going to be able to try and find similar opportunities as those. Um, because So right now, stocks are continuing to rally. This is a stock that we just bought the, the calls on today, Imogen. Obviously, we've been speaking about that. 
Um, and uh, there's going to be great opportunities like this while the upward movement continues. But um, uh, one thing to remember is that it's, it, the market will always have those. There's always going to be stocks that go up. There's always going to be stocks that go down in any market condition. It's a matter of finding these, these, the opportunities that are set up with the perfect patterns, with the perfect climate around them to let them soar or plummet. So what is March Madness trading? So the last year we did the big ones. Big one number one, big one number two. This year, the first quarterly class is March Madness. So what, we are, I, I, what we've been doing for the last several weeks uh, is spending a lot of time in research and development. So uh, I've developed a, I've been working on a scan for the last nine months um, in terms of bringing it to its uh, point of perfection. And that's what I've been doing mostly for the last few weeks in terms of uh, locating uh, trading opportunities, is using that. Uh, and it's, as you can see from the results, if you've been observing our executive summaries, that, that, that's been extremely profitable. Um, the, uh, the criteria that are built into the process of what we've been doing and what March Madness is all about is using all of our top strategies, so Fallen Angels, um, the Stochastic Bully Bull, uh, this new strategy that I've been using, using all of those to then build a, a, a master watch list and then take that master watch list and then go through it with over 30 criteria in total, both fundamental and technical. So uh, we've, I've gone through the five minute chart, the 15 minute chart, the one hourly chart, the daily chart, the weekly chart, the monthly chart. All of the insiders, who's buying, who's selling, what is their track record? Um, what sector are they in? How strong or weak is it? What's the P to E ratio? Everything you can possibly imagine. And we've created this monster scan. And what, we've, um, what, what I spent the better part of 12 hours doing yesterday was actually going through every possible long from every possible scan we use and, uh, and screening it with these filters. And um, what we've now developed is the, is the master list of trading opportunities. So um, what this course is all about, it's uh, 397. Um, and of course, you can sign up there at acornwealthcorp.com forward slash March. And um, what we do here is we're going to be giving you that list. So we'll actually be, there's a one hour um, on-demand video that I've recorded that you'll get tonight. And that will take you through um, all of the stocks we've selected for the, the top trades we're looking for and, and, and whatever options with trades. Um, what we've also created is, a, um, um, is an upgrade of the Big One document that we were in that last year. We've created a, um, a new document, color codes, everything. So um, you can see the, the ratings of all of the different stocks. And so as you, um, as you go through and actually use this strategy beyond March in April and May, being a breathing document that you can track any trade and uh, as you, it, it gives you all the checkpoints to look at on each stock and will color grade it based on what you type in. So it can show, you can visually see what the best trades are based on this strategy. Um, we're also going to then be doing a live, so after you've gone through the trade setups, and gone through the, the trade document that we send you. Um, we'll then be doing a live class next week, a two-hour workshop on Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern. And that's going to be where we then go through all of those positions, um, analyze the updates or any changes that uh, the stock's doing and look at how they're moving between now and then. Um, obviously, yeah, another really important thing is to actually talk about why out of the hundreds or thousands of stocks in the spectrum out there, why did we choose these ones? And there's about five or six right now that are um, my absolute favorites. IMGN was one of them, is one of them. And um, uh, so why did we pick those from all of the other ones you see on the list? Why are some of the ones on your list that I left on there red, do not trade? Why did we say do not trade on that one, but we said yes, get this one when they look almost exactly the same? How do we pick? the high probability stock versus the low probability stock so that you can understand the rationale. Um, obviously then we're going to be teaching you how to manage the trade, 
how we pick the option price, strike price, um, position sizing, but what's the rationale behind that that we've used, um, and uh, obviously entry and exit on how we go and how we go through that. Now, um, one of the gifts that we're going to be giving to you, um, we will be offering this to uh, to the public, but um, if if you are watching this in the recording recorded format um, or uh, live right now, um, we are offering you the uh, bonus on this. So um, uh, most of you have been through the big one and know what that's all about. And um, now, obviously, as you know, the big one is normally um, $697. And we are going to be including that one for you complimentary. OK, so the big one three will also be included in this. So we don't know how long this rally is going to continue for. So we could maybe be only three weeks of enjoying these trades that we've spent the um, last few weeks finding. Um, and, and if that's the case, that's OK. Because over the last three weeks, we've also been researching, with that same amount of depth, the best shorts and waiting for them to come around. So um, when the market turns, when we break open range to the downside, and when the money flow starts to correct the downside on the S&P, we're going to be already ready <laughs> with what shorts we want to take and what options we want to look for. So um, with that, the big one three comes included. Um, and uh, what we're going to be looking for is um, uh, when you, with that, that, that will launch as soon as the market starts to turn. So as soon as it starts to turn, we launch into the big one three. Uh, and the big one three will, um, will have the Again, the, the, the live lesson at the beginning, where we teach you the rationale, how we've gone about the scan, what we're looking for, et cetera, et cetera. And, and, what, you know, and, and give you the document that you can then download that has all the criteria that the stock has to meet for us to trade it, just like we give you with the March Madness. So you have all the rationale, every checklist right there in front of you. And then um, once we do that live lesson, we'll then be running the scan, going through our favorite stocks, and then over two months, we'll be doing um, a, an update every two weeks on, uh, on what those positions are doing, as well as any new positions that we find in that strategy over that two-month period. So this basically covers you um, for the rest of the rally and then for what could potentially be a very big, nasty drop after that. So um, uh, that's why we put this together for um, uh, for this. It's a you know it's, it's the one of our proudest products, and it's where I know a lot of people have done very well. Um, I, I wanted to share a couple of comments that I had in the email just in the last couple of weeks. Um, um, this is from Diane. I hope you don't mind, don't mind Diane, if you're if you're listening to this. Uh, I'm too, too, I'm so glad to send you guys. I share that when anyone asks, I do think you could probably. We're throwing some statistics to let people know how successful your selections were in the Christmas wish list. Now, that was the last time we did a big one. Um, the Christmas wish list, if anyone wants to see it, you can email, it to, email us and we'll send it to you. Um, I think about 80% of the longs and shorts all performed and did um, triple digit returns, um, or at least double uh, when you average it out after the losses. Uh, and this is an example of that. Uh, this was an email I had yesterday. Um, it's actually a completely different email, but at the very end of it, um, thank you, Kirk, by the way, if you're listening. Uh, I forgot to mention that I've doubled my account with your trade recommendations for the big one class and Christmas wish list. It's helped my confidence too, but not in the way this class has. Obviously, the email was something about a different class he's doing. Thank you, Kirk. Um, and um, but again, these, these are not just our trade setups. They're not recommendations. Um, uh, so. Uh, please obviously utilize your own discretion, but um, uh, but uh, these are ideas for you to go away and, and take away. And um, um, and this one last one, this is uh, this is from our last big one class from the Christmas wish list, I believe. Just want to show you how guys are pleased with your services. Main trading account up 115 percent. So separate IRA accounts up 132. That includes commissions. Uh, and there we go. So, um, and we can keep going through those. But anyway, 
Um, so look, we, we wanted to put together a really special offer for you so that it's, um, you're covered for both the long and the short, just in case it changes direction in only a couple of weeks time or a month's time. And uh, we're going to pop you right into the big one two class and you won't have to spend the 697. It's all going to be included in that, uh, in that for you. So um, uh, I hope it's, uh, it's worth it. If not, um, by, by, no, by, by no means will we not be still here looking for excellent trade setups here in the trading room every Tuesday, Thursday. And, um, but this is kind of taking it to the next level. And uh, we, it's a very specialized strategy that's um, based on what's happening in the market today. And so we do go out the extra mile and we're, um, we're doing a lot of extra research to find these. And, um, that uh, you probably don't want to be doing yourself necessarily. So, um, so with that, um, I will uh, leave it there, and um, I will be more than happy to answer any questions if you do have them. But uh, simply, um, you can just enroll there at acornwallcorp.com forward slash March. So yes, the live trading is next week, Wednesday the 30th at 8 p.m. Pacific. 8 p.m. Eastern, sorry, 5 p.m. Pacific, and um, and I look forward to seeing you uh, seeing you all there.